Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Knife Legion. Let's play some more Dead Nord. We're on to mission three. Finally, we got over that initial hump. We actually made it back with some knowledge. We can trade with Earth. No one's dead. There's actually no one I need to clone again. That's good. So, what are we going to do with all our money? Well, this is actually a very good question. I've been looking over the list, and there's actually not that much I want to buy. Right now, the light weapon suit and the medium shield suit will be very useful, and that is 4,000 knowledge, so basically half our money is already gone just on those. However, when I look in the primary field, I'm not really sure there's much here I want to buy. We've got some medium weapons, some medium beams, but unfortunately, they can't be used. The light weapon suit doesn't have enough weapons ports to actually mount any of these. They require eight weapon ports and the light weapon suit only has six and we can't buy a medium weapon suit because it's not on the list so that kind of sucks um, the l small shock launcher we could equip that but I don't really like the idea of launchers, they're kind of explosive weapons very bad at damaging the ship and we've had a lot of trouble with that so far now in addition, the medium shield suit does give us lots more defensive options, it's got nine defensive ports. However, based on the kind of spectral attacks we're facing, there's not actually anything here that's really going to be great for that. A uh, sp strong spectral scanner could be useful, but we'd have to get a medium uh, sensor suit for that. Uh, sidearms, there's not really anything there that we want. And uh, the passives, we could take a medium spectral shield but that requires eight defensive ports and then we couldn't put a standard field on our suit guys so they wouldn't be able to protect anyone else um, all in all it's a bit of a bugger standard field unfortunately requiring two defense ports the medium shield suit having nine so we've got a bit of a tricky situation here and I think I actually have a solution which is a terrible one rather than buying any new equipment or new weapons which is what I really wanted I'm actually going to get rid of the light weapon suit we're going to take a medium tech suit no that's also a terrible idea no no I know what I'm talking about don't worry now that does use up most of our knowledge, but I think it's well spent. Everyone will be better protected, and my basic plan is that with that with that loadout, we can actually put our weapons guys with the basic weapons in the medium shield suit and still give them the small rifle. And you can also have a combat knife and. Unfortunately, I can't afford to give you the small power recharger because you don't have enough tech slots. That's a bit of a shame. Um, you get the medium shield suit. So basically, everyone's going to be in medium shield suits. Um, some of them will have the standard field. And some of them... Ooh, medium blast field. I d oh, we must have picked that up. That's interesting. Didn't realise I owned that already. Medium blast field. What does that do? Ballistic plus three, blast plus five, beam plus three, melee plus. Hmm. Yeah, that's actually a good thing to equip for that. So you can have that. You can also take a standard pistol. Can't fit anything else on you. So that medium blast field. It's like the standard field. It's specialised for blast. It does lots of ballistic, blast, and beam and melee protection. Um, something, if it was a spectral, a medium spectral field, that would have been great, but I'm not even sure that exists, so don't worry. But yeah, we're going to put everyone into shield suits. Um, you can also have that medium blast field with a pistol. So we'll be a lot better protected than before. Our tech will have the medium tech suit, just offers that much more protection. We've skipped over light suits entirely here, which is probably good for the third mission. Now we might actually be able to afford a 
better. Hmm. Maybe we can afford a better tech tool. We've still got fifteen hundred knowledge left. What tech tools are available? A level one firewaller, level two scrambler. We can't afford that. A level one firewaller. That would make our firewalls that much better. Let's actually buy that. I think that's a good. That's a good fit for us. There we go. It's on board. Our fabricator can now print this out. Our little three D printer we have on board. So there we go. Level one firewaller. You can also have a pistol, and you're equipped. And the last person here gets the medium shield suit. We could give them an axe. But I'm actually tempted to give them the small scattergun. We've got enough people in shield suits now that I'm not really going to be worried about decompressing a room. Everyone will be fine to walk through it, apart from Williams. Williams can just get a bunch of shields from people and should be okay, as I understand it. We have had some trouble with that in the past, but hey... So there we go. Unfortunately, limited by the lack of available decent weapons, we're still going in with fairly basic weapons, the uh, small scattergun and the small rifle. But, oh, actually, I want to give you a combat knife, don't I? There we go. But what can I say? Hopefully, this will work out okay. So our next mission is to infiltrate the Darani. No, sorry, the Denari. So this will be our third mission. We'll um, execute the jump. Just now I'm going to take a look. We don't get a choice here. This is the mission we've been sent, and this is the mission we shall do. So, a couple of seconds to come out of FTL. All jumping from space to space. Sampling background radiation for anomalies. Nice. I always like the little bit of detail they put in there. It would have been very simple to make this a uh, click a button and you're there. Done. But I like the little bit of effort. So what do we know about the Denari? It's an industrial freighter. Sensors have picked up many motion sources. That could be bad. The structural integrity is low. Be cautious. Many areas inaccessible. Well, that would be a problem, but we're pretty much all in shield suits, so I think we're going to be okay. Internal security priority is to sentinels. Many energy fluctuations detected. That's a problem. So there are going to be lots of sentinels, lots of gun turrets around. They're going to be powerful. If you've seen some of the previous missions, gun turrets have fucked us up. But, okay. Now, we, our objective is to recover the ship's log, so we do have to go from one end of the ship to the other. That, again, could be a problem, but it does mean we can basically just travel in a straight line if we want to get this over with quickly. And I'm thinking we probably want to get this over with quickly. So, what do we know about the Denari? 22 rooms? Not that big, though. No, actually... Well, she's smaller. She's got a smaller internal area than the first ship we boarded. Just a lot more rooms, and yeah, security is all about the gun turrets this time. That's pretty bad. Um, lights are pretty down low. Atmosphere's in good condition. Okay, so we're going to be facing Spectre Type A's and Spectre Type B's. The A's are kind of slow moving. Ethereal manifestations, forearms, flying, not very nice. The Type Bs we know very little about, but all of them appear to be able to move through walls and solid objects. So, they've given us a bad time in the past. But we're all in medium suits now, that gives us a lot of protection. Let's see what happens. Let's get power, network and location up. I never really bother about those last two. Okay, that kind of usual thumping sound in the background that's becoming very, very common for this campaign, and I do not like. We found a dead alien and a personnel log. Let's just check here. Now, we could face Type Cs on this mission, so I do want to check. Yeah, so they did. Okay, so Captain Algillen wants this thing studied. We've prepared some sentinels for good measure. So they set up defensive guns before everyone on board was killed. Which is probably why we're going to struggle with them. And let's see. Puncture runes and hair pulled out. Nice. So again, sounds like melee damage. That's not terrible. Uh, okay. How do we want to do this? I think... 
Ooh. Damn it. Joan just shorted out all the power. So they're, while they're slowly recharging, let's actually get our tech onto this console. Put a fire... Oh, there we go. Get a firewall up, and then remotely I would like to unlock that door. Is there any chance of you remotely on? No, you've got not got any power to do it, have you? Okay. Well, people are slowly recharging. Get them to either side of the door. Okay, Wilson. Walker and Foster are my two people with guns. Ooh, we can see a little bit in there. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, there's a turret in there somewhere. I can't see it, but it can see me. Okay, let's try something. Okay, everyone. Oh, damn it, Jones short circuited again. I had a plan here, and it was a good plan. Yeah, slowly recharging. Let's take off those shields so they can recharge their power. Basically, everyone's going to protect Walker. Walker's going to head in, spot the turret, and then we hack it. Of course, that does require me to actually have power if Joan would mind. Are you. No. Oh, you can't. You haven't got a projector field. That's alright. It's because you're. I keep thinking they're in a shield suit. And it's the same thing, but it's not. Put a fire one up there. Okay, Walker. Just spot the turret. There we go. Turret spotted. Great. That's all I need you to do. Get out. Even with two shields on from medium suits, taking a lot of damage there. But we've got it. We got the gun turret. That is a bit pretty crappy initial bit of damage there. But it couldn't really be helped. Now let's get out of this room before anyone takes down the firewall. I haven't seen too many watchers, but they are around. We'll have to be careful about getting back out as well. Okay, watchers trying to shut the door, but we're in the room, so that's okay. A couple of bodies. Haven't actually seen any hostiles apart from the gun turrets. Now, there were many motion sources. Found a schematic for a medium shock field. That's not bad. Williams, I want you to get me a hack on here. Give me a firewall. Just so they can't play around with my signals mostly what I'm worried about. What is that? I've spotted an artifact. Ooh, audio feed is being here. That watch is still causing trouble. Okay, let's see if we can't beat that. So that artifact should help. Spectral enemies can be a pain in the ass. Storeroom B. Okay. Foster, I want you just to step in. Okay, nothing shot you, so that's good. Let's keep moving forward. Okay. Found another dead body. We've already collected another 2,000 knowledge, so that's not bad. Oh, audio feeds. Been hit. That was the watchers that time. Grab that download. Medium cold field. I would like some weapons, but this defensive stuff doesn't hurt. Now. Oh. Okay, we're okay. Have we lost? Yeah, we have. I'm actually going to fall back. Actually, let me just check something quickly. Walker, just to unlock that door. Just a corridor. Okay. Alright. Oh, shit. Hostiles are in the room. Not sure what they are. Type A's. God, we're spraying bullets everywhere. Good job we've got all these shield suits. There's a Type B behind it. This is our first kind of hostile contact apart from that turret. Ooh. Uh, Williams is getting hurt because the room's gone down so low. Okay, okay, it's fine. I'm just going to put a shield on you. With, let's see. Richards, put a shield on you. Take it off Walker. There we go. That should keep Williams okay. Another Type A. I'm trying to get back to this hack console so we can try and 
slow down these watchers. Okay. So we still got the turret actually, that surprises me. There are a number of watchers moving around though. The data feeds being hit which is a bit of a pain. What I want to try and do is wait for the watchers to be up past this end of the ship and then then put the firewalls in place to kind of pin them all off and give them a, a long wall they have to go down. But this one's being a bit slow. And I won't be able to do it while they're in, in the way. But here he comes now. As long as we don't see another one travelling down, I think we might be able to get away with this. Okay, data feed's being screwed up, but that's okay. Alright, firewall that. Firewall that. Firewall that. And then we haven't got enough power, so we've just got to wait a little bit. Take control of that turret again. Actually, no. There's no point taking control of that turret again. We don't need it right now. We'll need to get it on the way back. But not right now. Okay. I'm going to blitz across this room. Hopefully Williams... No, Williams is taking damage. She's got a shield on her. I don't understand why. This is the problem when you've got people who aren't in shield suits. And was that Foster? But Foster is an issue. I don't understand. Foster should be protected. Could be could be I'm not understanding the mechanics properly. Turn that off. Okay. We just want to get to the bridge. Take the junction here. Brenda short circuited us that time. Found a couple of store rooms. Not really gonna worry about them too much. We're gonna stack up behind this door, which could be a trouble if there's a turret right on the other side. But once we've got sufficient power back plan is we just open it up and go for it. I do not want Williams at the front though. We'll send, I guess Wilson actually. Let's have a peek inside. Oh shoot. There's a turret. Okay, I couldn't see it. Wilson, I need you to move in. I need you to spot the turret for me. There we go. Okay, Wilson, don't die on me. No! God damn it! Oh, they shut the door on her. They shut the door just as she was about to get out. Crap. So we could... Oh, audio feed's been hit. So that was one of our shield shoots down as well. That actually gives us a bit of a problem. This could be a tough mission. Turrets are never something to play around with. Uh, there's hostiles coming up the corridor which we have around us as well. Type B. Okay, let's kill this thing. Just so we don't have to worry about it. Getting a little bit of knowledge there about the Type Bs. Let's see, is there a way around that turret? Or are we going to have to hack it? I think we're going to have to pull back, hack it, and then make a run through that room. And there was a hostile behind us there as well. Williams? Williams, where are you going? Stay with us. Don't wander off. Okay. How close are we to the bridge? Not massively far away, but not that close either. So we need to do something about what's in cargo hold A. I've only got one shield suit left, which makes this a bit more difficult than I would have liked. Could use a hack terminal, because this is a long way to move in. Whoa, okay, what the hell? Okay, so Type 3 just came through the wall at us. Okay, so that's a Type C. That, was, that wasn't too bad, actually. I mean, we were able to focus it down. This is the problem, we can't actually just hang around. Okay, yeah, we're taking damage in this room again. Unfortunately, I need... Who 
was that I'm not sure who's taking damage at this point. I need to use this hack terminal to try and shut down some of these turrets. Okay. Let's put a firewall up here. Firewall there. Can I get a firewall there and then control in time? need more power. That watcher, it depends on where you're going to be in the way now, aren't you? That's not good. Yep, you're really in the way there, my friend. Also, that is being hit a lot. Now, don't stop. Why are you stopping there? Damn it. This is making it very difficult to get control of this turret. I need that watcher out of the way so I can actually take control, otherwise that turret is just going to kill all of us. And one turret is that dangerous. Yeah, it's not going to let me do this, is it? That firewall's holding up pretty well. Oh no, now it's gone. Okay. Just got to wait for all these watchers to get out of the way. Which could be a problem. Depending on what these two are doing. Yeah, shit. There's too many watches. The security on this ship is just too much. Standing around like this isn't good as well. We are very likely to get attacked by something. There's still a watcher between me. There's a watcher right there, which is blocking what I need to do. The only other thing I could try is going around, seeing if maybe storeroom C has access. But that every time we cross this room, someone's going to take damage. Oh, hang on, was that it? That might have been it. Okay, firewall, control. Yes. Okay, we got it. I would have liked to unlock those doors remotely, but it's not going to happen. Okay, we've got to go. We've got to go, go, go. We don't have long until they break down that firewall. And... Um, take control of that turret again. Someone unlock the damn door. Okay, get out. Who's taking really bad hurt? Walker. Walker, I'm sorry. I've got to keep the tech alive at this point. Okay, we've still got control. Okay. Richards, no, that is not the time. God damn. Oh, okay. Gun turret is firing on our side. Okay. Richardson. Seriously, this game just doesn't want to give you a chance. Come on, this is taking forever. Come on. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Yeah, we've actually we lost the firewall. We've gotta get out of this room now. Shit, shit, shit. They all they almost got that back. We've got to close this door behind us. There we go. Okay, well that was horrible. Richardson losing communication at that point, just the absolute worst. There's a hostile in front of us. They're opening the door behind us. And we just lost that turret, so I can't advance back. Okay, we've got to kill this type B without moving at all. There we go. Okay. Crap. Richards! Oh god, there's a bunch of them now. Richardson is caught. Been pinned. Okay. We somehow survived that, surprisingly. Oh god damn it, there's another one right behind us. He's coming through the walls at us. Oh shit, who was that? Walker. Walker's dead. We've got three of them on us. Okay. Got to make a stand here. Yeah, there's another one coming. Shit. 
Shit, shit, shit. Okay, they are dying slowly but surely. We're beating the crap out of this corridor. And that turret behind us could start engaging. I need to shut that door. Keep us safe from behind. Richardson's lost comms again. Man, this game's throwing everything at me this time. We're just not having a fun time at all. Come on. See, this and I say this every time, but this is just an annoying game mechanic because you can't do anything. It just forces you to sit and twiddle your thumbs. Okay. We need money at this point. We need to start investigating some of these bodies on our way through. I know it's wasting time, but if we get out of this mission, I'm going to need to clone two people minimum. And we get paid a lot for these bodies. That'll do. And start moving up again. Everyone is really badly injured. And I didn't even see if there what's on the other side of this door yet. If there's a turret. Okay. Everyone get in the room and then shh, fuck up that artifact for me. There's a download there. I'm actually downloading a lot of stuff. Medium spectral field. Now that's something very useful. Ah, crap. There's a monster in here. Or an alien, or whatever the hell these things are. Ooh, we found a bunch of artifacts. If we can take these out, it will weaken these spectral entities. Because they're, they're kind of tethered to them. It powers them. Okay, we managed to do that. There's no hack terminal in here, unfortunately. So I can't put any more firewalls up. Hopefully there's not a turret in here. I can't see one. You can usually kind of spot them on the power grid and that. Okay. We're actually not doing bad on money. Okay. Is there no hack terminal in here either? Must be. Nope. And my concern is, I think I hear a turret on the other side of this door. Okay, something is howling in the distance. Um, okay, I'm going to try and unlock this door. Damn it. How far are we from the bridge? We, the bridge must be very close at this point. There is a hack there. Right, let's get on that. Give me a hack. If we wait for that watcher to come back, I should be able to start blocking these guys. Here it comes. Let's just let it go down. Firewall, firewall. Not enough power for a firewall? Really use a third power firewall. Also, there's power. Decrease the power. That'll help put it into the reserve. Okay. Let's investigate that body. Can I investigate that body, please? You're going to do that bug again, aren't you? Okay. This should be the bridge on the other side of this door. don't see a turret, which is good, and we can get the ship's log. Okay, grab that for me. Okay, we've got to reach an escape hatch. Grab that last bit of knowledge. Richardson! Richardson, you're the worst person ever. What are you doing? And where are you going? What the hell? Okay, I'm leaving, I'm leaving Richardson behind, because they are just a pain in my ass. Ah, damn it, now we've got to wait. Okay, we need to find an escape hatch, preferably one that's not the entire other end of the ship past two turrets. Okay, we're going to start gambling here a bit. There's usually one not too far from the bridge. Damn. Okay, we're going to start... We're going to work our way down here. There's 
another f okay we're going to take out that okay there was another artifact destroyed picked up a little bit more knowledge but no way out it's possible there's one this direction but the doors they're destroyed we'd have to blow the room apart and that's when people start dying I think I saw something in the room as well. How are my firewalls holding up? Let's refresh one of those. Okay, that should keep us safe for the time being. Let's move. Okay, we're going to check some of these side doors because I don't want to have to go all the way down to engineering to get out of here. Living quarters. Is there a turret in there? No, but there is an artifact. We'll kill that. Haven't seen a hostile for a while. That's good. That door works. Okay. There, we may be able to get, get out this way. If we're very, very lucky. A couple of bodies. Okay, we're going to try something. Richardson's going to have to go solo here. Now she should be okay in this corridor. If that door's busted, she's going to have to blast it down herself. Which could take a while, she's only got a pistol. I don't know can't see an escape hatch apart from one all the way back in engine room A. Come on. If there is one in there we might be able to just run through quickly. No. I didn't exp I was it makes sense there's not going to be one in a room that's locked off like that. Okay. Let's start getting back out of here. Okay, we're going to check out the other side here. Ooh, more power. That will weaken the turrets, it will weaken the sentinels. Also, we've got a tech terminal here. Let's get some more firewalls up. Really happy I brought the uh, firewaller. I think it's made a big difference so far. They're actually resetting the power behind me as well, which is a bit of a pain. Ah, shoot, there's something in here with us. And it's a big one as well. Okay, we're going to try and run past it, because right now I don't really have the firepower for this kind of fight we're doing is damaging the ship. It's not earning us anything to stand and fight. Let's see what's in here. Kind of rushing a bit. Damn it. Let's take down that power. Is there more power to be taken from that? Looks like it. Okay. does take us to somewhere new. What's at the end of this corridor? Damn it. Short circuits are never fun, but they are kind of inevitable, no matter what you do. We just need an escape hatch. If we get an escape hatch, I'll be a happy man. Preferably an escape hatch that doesn't have a turret sitting on top of it. No such luck. Okay. We can quickly put some more hacks up. Although it's got a very long way to travel. That's a problem. Unfortunately, there's no way apparently around Cargo Hold A, which is the problem, because that's where the turret is. Okay, 
now at least keep us safe. I mean, watches themselves don't kill you, but they screw things up to allow you to die. Like when we lost Wilson, who got trapped in the room with a turret, and they shut the door on her. It's just never a very fun experience. Now that's not going to last long, is it? Ooh, is there... Well, there's a body here with to check, so that's more knowledge. We've actually picked up a lot of knowledge. 12,500 knowledge. That is a destroyed hatch. We're not going to waste time blowing that down. I think we've proven to ourselves now there's never anything useful on the other side of a destroyed hatch. This hatch, however, is not destroyed. What I'm hoping is either it allows us to get past that cargo bay, or... It does. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, or power. Decrease the power. Gotta keep the power down so these guys are weaker. Okay. Where does that lead to? It's gonna be a corridor that leads up there. Probably nothing... It's not gonna lead us anywhere, but there might be some corpses to investigate, like that. Something is very unhappy with me. Oh shit, it's right behind me as well. What are you? Type B. That's a pain. But we've got to deal with it. Can someone just get in his face and shoot it for me? There we go, he's down. Okay, we'll check out this other door. We just need to get to an escape hatch. If I can just find one. Normally there's two, at least, on a ship. But we might be unlucky. Yeah, this is just going to lead us to the cargo hold. Richardson has lost communications again, so we're going to have to stand around and do bugger all. I mean, it doesn't even make sense, because he could tell that these two are trying to do something, but no, he's going to refuse and just stand there like a muppet. Okay. We've still got quite a long way to get home. Just need an escape hatch. I can't believe there's none anywhere on the ship apart from in the cargo. Uh, in the engine room. But what are you to do? Okay. We've still got our tech, so this is still manageable. Let's get Williams up by the Tom console. Okay. So what we've got to do is wait for these watches to get out of the way. Okay. There's just so many of them. Even if they are a bit weaker now, it's not going to really help me much. Give me a firewall there. Give me control. Why have you not got enough power for that? You should have more than enough power. You should be able to put up a firewall and take control. Okay. We're just going to go for it. I was going to try and put layer a few more firewalls up, but... Oh, crap. No! Williams! Get off, Williams! Damn it! Oh, fuck. That was our tech. We just lost our tech. We're kind of trapped by this. Okay, we've got to try and get past it. No, Richardson is stuck. It's pinned Richardson down. It's going to come on. Move, move, move. Turn that alarm off. Richardson. Richardson, now is not the time, you muppet. I w oh, God, I'm leaving you to die. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised you died. You're an idiot. All you had to do was run away, but no, you decided to stop. Okay, we've got to get out of this room before that turret is turned back on. There we go. Actually, the firewall just went down. That's how close that was. Okay, so we've got Foster. Now, they're in a shield suit, but... All they've got is a small rifle. Where's that last turret? Engine room B. There is no way I can get through engine room B without a tech. 
Losing Richardson then has really done a number on us, I'm afraid. We've got to find another route out of here. There must if if there's not another escape hatch, we're done. Keep decreasing the power might help make the turret a bit weaker. We might be able to just run past it, but we're already quite badly hurt. Okay, what's in this room? Is that just a corridor? Yeah, that's just a corridor that doesn't lead us anywhere. I'm picking, investigating these bodies and picking up the knowledge, even though it's not going to help us. Because, well, I'm not even sure Foster's going to make it through this room, let alone anything else. Foster is popping all of her stims as well. Okay, we've got to try and make this run. Yeah, she's getting quite badly hurt. She might not even make it. Come on, get that door open. Move, move, move. Jesus, okay. This is pretty much it. This is one of the last doors we can check. If it doesn't lead to an escape hatch... It does not. It does lead to another door though. Keep decreasing the power. Nope, that wasn't what I told you to do, but fine. What's down here? Okay. We might be able to get out of here. I mean, the fact we've already lost everyone else on the team does kind of suck, because all that money we've gathered is not going to help. Okay, we can't go through that door. That turret is right there. I've got no way of getting rid of it. This is really tense. I'm going to be very upset if this mission is complete. Okay, got another engine room. It doesn't have an escape hatch in it. Oh, damn it. Okay, let's zoom out, take another look. So we know there's an escape hatch there, but I can't get to it because of the turret. The turret's just going to kill us. We've not spotted any other turrets in the rest of the sh uh, any other escape hatches in the rest of this ship. Are there any doors we haven't been through yet? Can't go into these sections. It's unlikely there's anything there anyway, but... So that's the only door we haven't actually checked. And I don't think I can get to that because there's a turret in there as well. Yep, yeah, we're done. We are finished. There's no way out of this, unfortunately. I can try and make a run through engine room B, but that turret is going to kill us as soon as we open the door. And unfortunately, there is no other way off the ship for Foster. If Richardson was still alive, we might have been able to get away, and it's just very unfortunate. The game was really against us there by having Richardson lose comms when we were trying to get them to run away from something, and she just stood there and got eaten alive. But that is how this game works sometimes. Sometimes it is just brutal. Just absolutely brutal. God damn it. I had high hopes for this campaign, but this is going to be it. Say goodbye to people. Say goodbye to everyone you've ever known and loved. Just run. Just run. <laughs> oh, wow. That was even quicker than I thought. One shot and she was dead. Okay. Well, there we go. That's uh, that's the end of that campaign in Dead Nought. Uh, this has been brutal, this series. We have just had nothing but bad luck. Maybe I'm terrible at the game, I'm not sure, but we are just... This is turning into less of a fun game to play and more of a, more of something to punish ourselves with every time we load it up. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy that, do leave a like, leave a comment, uh, feel free to subscribe, and hopefully, possibly, maybe, I will see you later. Bye.